We are finishing off our healthy, wealthy, and wise Monday with a delicious dish. Chef Matthew Byrne from Kitchen is joining us. Hi, Chef. Hi. Nice to see you again. It's been a while. It's been too long. All right. Don't be a slacker. Come back more often. All right. So uh, what's on the menu today? I see some beautiful ahi tuna. Well, in, in the theme of healthy, wealthy, and wise, we're always staying, trying to stay right. healthy, but we're trying to get as much flavor and as much goodness out of it. I like it. the so, way you think. Uh, beautiful ahi tuna that we buy from a really good uh, place. You know, you can buy it at Whole Foods. If not, you can go to Independent Seafoods. That's where we get it from. Okay. He's just finally opened after 40 some years. He's open to the public now. All right. So I think Tuesdays through Saturdays, Independent Seafood, and it's awesome. He has the Anything best Anything in best particular fish. you should look for? I mean, first of all, a good place to buy it from. Get to know your person you're okay. buying meat and fish from, obviously. You right. want someone trustworthy, someone you really believe in, and support them a lot, and they'll give you the best stuff. So good. tuna, obviously, you don't want any smell. You want, mm -hmm. you want it to be glisten. You don't want it to look old. It looks know. great. Yeah, it's great tuna. And, you know, with this dish, we, we, it's all about the vinaigrette. We, we, don't, we call it a sesame soy vinaigrette, but I really like to call it sesame soy stuff because okay. we use this for a lot of stuff in the restaurant. It's a great <laughs> marinade. You can put it as a salad dressing. You can use it with tuna. You can put it on fish. You can put it on meat. It's, it's just great stuff. So for the sake of television and going a little quicker, mm -hmm. we don't have the blender here. Right. But all, we blend all these ingredients here, rice wine vinegar, uh, sesame oil, soy, some blended oil, some garlic, and some fresh ginger. Yeah. Blend that into a, in a nice blender. Strain it through a... Uh, uh, you know, a little strainer, and then you can put it in a little squirt bottle or in a bowl, great. and then you can you have your dressing. That dressing, like I said, is great on chicken and right. everything. But t today we're going to use it on the, the tuna. So beautiful tuna, yellow beautiful. fin tuna. All right, so we've got two minutes, so go ahead and get started. We'll Perfect. continue talking Absolutely. as you go along. Now, for somebody who uh, doesn't consider themselves maybe a very, you know, good cook, is this something they a should try at home, and how how should they go about it? Oh, I think so. I think the, the trick with the tuna is that buy the best, mm -hmm. and then if you're you know, if you have, your knife skills are a little suffer, you can freeze the tuna. Flash freeze it in your f freezer, bring it out. That's going to accomplish two things. You're going to kill some of the bacteria. So for people who are, you know, maybe okay. a little weary of that, yeah, right, right. kill a little of the bacteria, then you're able to cut it into perfect little cubes because it's semi-frozen okay. and let it cool down that way. I like that idea. Um, then, a little salt, pepper, and uh, yeah, and I mean, this is really simple. Buy a really nice ripe mango, Beautiful. you know, s soft to the touch. Again, with the avocado, soft to the touch. Make your vinaigrette. It takes about... It's more time weighing the ingredients, getting the ingredients together than it is to actually make it. So we I was going to ask you, how long does it take to make? No, uh, probably 30 seconds in a blender. Wow. Really easy. Glad you didn't bring the blender. It makes so much noise. You know, trying to, hey, so Matthew, so what do you do now? Exactly. But this is good like this. So we put our tuna that we toss in that beautiful sesame soy vinaigrette mm -hmm. into our little mold. Obviously, if you don't have a mold, it's not the end of the world. It just makes for a better right. presentation. Yeah, you can stack it with your hands if you have exactly. to. Exactly. Then we add a little bit of our avocado, mm -hmm. fresh Haas avocado. If you, like the, if you like the other avocado better, feel free. Put avocado in there. Obviously, great for you. Great fat. Help lower cholesterol. Good. Same thing with Delicious the, stuff. Same thing with the sesame oil here. Then we take a little bit of mango on yeah. top. Nice ripe mango. Yeah, mango's awesome. Hey, what's on tap at uh, your restaurant these days? Well, now that we're moving into the fall, this is a, a classic dish. We just use this little uh -huh. thing to kind of make Push it, it down. look fresh and mm -hmm. nice. And then we, look at that. Voila. we can use this. We can unmold that. Magic, yeah. Beautiful. Maybe a little bit of sriracha for a little spice just to garnish the, the dish. Makes it look pretty and right? it's a good, yeah, it's delicious. Some microgreens from Pantano Farms out west. Then a little bit of more of our vinaigrette. So what's on top of the kitchen right now is this ahi dish is always on the menu. It's All been right. on since we've opened. It's one of our best sellers. But as we're moving into the fall, some pumpkin white chocolate bread pudding as a dessert with a little bit of uh, uh, dolce de leche ice cream. Awesome. Uh, we're doing duck, a lot more duck, a lot more uh, meatier things. Our kitchen meatballs, which we have. And you're working a lot these days. Well, we added Mondays back starting All November. Right. And then uh, we'll add Sundays the middle of the month, and then we'll go seven days for season. Tis the season, exactly. Tis the season. All right. And, and your grab and go is ready to go. Grab and go has been going really well. Okay. Soup, salad, sandwiches, little pieces of our coconut cake, our chocolate pie, stuff All like right. that. Um, and it's going great. We always have new sandwich specials and new salad specials there as All well. Right. Save me a bite. Good oh, stuff. Please. Thank you for coming back and uh, hanging out with us. All right.